And I accidentally played for about a few days before I hit play. Or excuse me, record. So let's fix that. Um, yeah, I really don't have to pay France a bunch of money to get this going, but... Oh, Provence being a little shit about it. Basically, the other option is to let Austria get tired of it because they're stuck in other stupid wars, but they're only fighting Ulm and Switzerland. I mean, it's not exactly uh, the heaviest of hitters there. Commonwealth. Austria, who hates you? France. Bohemia, who conveniently hates me also. And Venice. Hmm. Hmm. I've got Protestants up to my border. Oh, Switzerland's gone reformed. It's cute. This Coburg's also reformed. But, uh... Oh, Ansbach seems to... Uh, Nuremberg. That's impressive. Okay. Yeah, that's a much better province. Okay. What one of the worst names I've ever seen. Come on, France. Just get a nice big event, pay off your debt. French manpower is now low. Why is French manpower now low? Because you're recruiting like a madman. Okay. Now, hold on. Let's be smart. What are our other options here? France doesn't particularly like this now. How can we make France like it more? Join offensive wars. Okay, that's interesting. Trust. Well, shoot, do I not have the thing where I can convert favors? I don't think I have the thing where I can convert favors into willingness to do the damn fight. That's what I was hoping to see. Huh. Well, so much for that. What, do I just go ham on Cologne instead? Got a cute little peasant revolt here. Rugen. Oh yes, mighty Rugen would join. I've got a lot of cavalry. I've got 5,000 Cologne cavalry. Hmm. I mean, I've been training the shit out of my guys, so they're probably fine, but... Now, if I do this, I'm basically admitting that I'm not going to get any more Dutch territory for a while. Because I'm going to have to go through here... Basically, I'd, what, seize Westphalia? And seize Westphalia would be the option. And then I'd have to start getting over here eventually. But it is another way to get across. The other way is just go straight through Cleves. And then get to... Nope, that doesn't work. It's still Cologne in between. Still Cologne in between. And you know what? I think we will have to go after Cologne. Don't want to. But I think it's what needs to be done. Hope our country look a lot nicer too. But I just can't afford fighting with Austria on my own. Even though there's other wars on. 
France is just going to be a pain in the ass. So you know what? We're going to let it sit a little bit longer. We'll check the AE, make sure we're not wasting. Okay, so we got a little bit of time. Let a few years go, and if nothing comes around, then yep, we're going after Cologne. Now their army strength is getting screwed up. Why is your army strength getting screwed up, France? Where is your army, France? Is the French army like dead? The French army is smaller than me. If I fight Austria, it would be like a 1v1 almost. So hold on. Do I get ballsy and just go for it? <sighs> Milan won't do it. How's Milan in debt now? What the hell is going on? I think we increased the army size. Wipe out Brabant's troops. Once Brabant's guys are gone, they're at 40... F hold on. Austria's at 34,000. Plus another 15,000. Doesn't seem right. Austria's at 50,000? Oh, that's why. I'm an idiot. I'm looking at the ledger. That's truly just Austria's line. It's not including the Hungarian troops, though. The other thing is including the Hungarian troops. That is the difference. And that is a big difference. Because Hungary still has a decent amount of resources to call upon. Okay, so we're going to sit back, see what happens for a bit. Pray that France can get its shit together. Oh, it'd be delicious just to walk over and stack wipe them. Okay, Pope. Don't forget about me, senpai. Grand Bank Fisheries. Price of salt. Up. Great. And there it is. More trade. More naval force limit. Get benign neglect. Sure as hell we'll get benign neglect. Settler chance and global trade power. So that was a whole lot of trade modifiers at once. And they're taking the coast big time. 957. Okay, Antigua's got sugar. That is some great new settler chance right now. So I think we'll probably just go St. Kitts next and just keep them in a line here. Austria, no longer great power. What the shit happened? Still at war with Ullman, Switzerland. It's just like, what do I, what if I hit, hit them with just a quick war? That's greedy. In a quick war, they don't see coming. Siege quickly. Austria's, no, it's too late now. Austria's already working on the capital there, a bunch of Hungarians. I'd have to win a bunch of, nah. Although, in the meantime, I can get you a little bigger. Do two more cannons. Let's do two more cannons. Should I do four more cannons? Yeah. Okay. Fleets are wooden wall. Stop deterioration. Yep. Definitely do not shut on the military right now. If Austria gets into a big knockdown drag out war with somebody, I'll go for it. Antigua. It cost me 118 guys right there. 
Okay, should be done. Nope. Okay, one more tick. Maybe. 992. 998. So it's six a tick. Lord, that's low mount. Great. Good amount of prestige. Yeah, could make it a state. Nope. Okay, we're a little over. Not by much. Still making a lot of money. France fixing your shit to forty four thousand. Make it happen. Make it happen. Definitely could use that extra prestige. Um uh, hmm. Tempting. Oh, here's a question. Is Austria in a golden age? I don't remember. Of course, they're doing counter espionage on me. No wonder that takes forever. Take a look at our options. No. Got some war exhaustion. Come up to Ulm. Yeah, Ulm's about to piece out of this in two seconds. Problems I really want to use this peasant revolt CB. Basically, we take an extra province over what I'd be able to normally, which when you're talking about the HRE is a big deal. And, oh, disgusting. Austria took Bern and Zurich. Oh, that's disgusting. France, you got your shit together? Nope. Yeah, the fact is, France seems just not to be paying off its debt, so I don't know what the hell it's doing. But even if I gave it, you know, 800 bucks, which I thought about doing, I don't think it would pay the debt. It might just invest it straight into buildings. Um, get some of that Republican tradition back. Antigua's doing work. Got to pick up the pace, though. Plane. Nope. Clergy loses some influence. We can do this. Officer selection questions. Oh, they really improved the length of these. That's good. They were always way too short. Burger influence. Oh, God, no. Yearly corruption. Trade company governing costs. Curtail the burgers. I might need to do that. Global tariffs. Trade fleets. And colonial subjects get a 10% goods modifier. Tempting. Cost to promote mercantilism. Merchant... Trade power. Brace free trade. Institution spread goes up big time.
Hmm. Brace the economic theory. Oh, we got a windmill there. I think I'm going to need to go with that. Goods produced. Goods produced and yearly inflation reduction. There it is. Do I go for it? Is England still Catholic? They're still Catholic. Oh crap, and they are on their, what, where's their last colony at? Here, sprinting 100 a year. You know what, we're just saying screw that, we're not gonna be able to get over there. Start setting up St. Kitts. I guess it's going to be the race for North America then. So that's not looking good otherwise. Columbian Exchange. Okay. We'd love to beat up Austria. Commonwealth. Hmm. Sweden? Do I actually have an issue with you, Sweden? Don't. You just don't care too much. So you are a rival of Great Britain. Improve some relations there. Going after Magdeburg, Lampert, Rupp, and Coburg. You can be defender of the Catholic faith. Yeah, things we're not going to be right now. Bad. Start setting up St. Kitts. 41%. Brace the reputation, apparently. Keep them or dump them. Honestly, we should probably dump them and then keep the next guy. And also, probably have a military leader worth a damn. Um, and you know. I think we just gotta go to war with Cologne. Oh wait, so Milan will do Cologne. Milan will also do here. Milan will probably get shit on. But that's okay. They just eat time. That's really all I need them to do. And I've got to move quickly. So use a bunch of territory. Because basically I'm going to have to full occupy the shit out of... Good old boy here very quickly. And I can probably do that. So let's think about how I'm going to do that. First of all, how many troops do I have? Do I have enough? Yes. We come down here. The first fight is here. Then we start fanning out. We call Milan, hopefully Austria and Hungary screw around there for a while. We may not get to be able to get a big piece off of these guys, but we can certainly get a piece. Silver tongued, great. So we need to take a province like Gelra, one that's very easy. Who will hate me? 
everybody will hate me. Do not piss off France. Really do not piss off France. Okay. France is only 421 bucks of debt. <sighs> Do we need France? Do we need France? Do we need France? Because if we can seize a bunch of territories... Let's let them figure themselves out here. We might just give them the money. What's going on? French manpower. I need to get my Diplo reputation up. So, this may be the move. Wait one more month, and sure, I've got all of that back. Probably should have thrown some heavies into my fleet. Did not. It's okay. I don't actually need to worry about that. The problem is the fort. I can't seize anything around here. I could seize a whole bunch of stuff up there. This is risky. Because if their armies get linked up together, I'm going to be in big shit. Use Frisia. It's basically, if I knock out their armies now in the strike, I'm dealing with 45,000 troops. I'm dealing with 51,000 troops. So they got an extra 15k on me. I don't have any military. Let's see what happens if I send the gift. And a gift. Man, if this doesn't work, this is going to be so freaking costly. Okay. Gift sent. Month tick. I didn't do it. God damn it. God freaking damn it. Okay. Well, here's going to be the moment. Okay. We're going for it. Maybe dumb. May set us back big time. We should be able to pull it off. Okay. I feel like butt puckering over this. There's no way to get France in, apparently. Well, there, there. Oh, shit. I have to seize. I picked the seize the capital seed. So got him an idiot. He didn't even get ticking war score. Captured 
three ships. Okay. Go here, heal, come back out. Why would you have to be dying to the peasants right now, Balan? Oh god. I sent you the money, France. How? How? God damn it. I could have asked them to prepare for war, and maybe that would have done it. Shit, that's what I was looking for, and I couldn't figure it out. Oh, they've got Moldavia, too. That's cute. Okay. And you know what? Yep. Not even thinking twice. Get that breach. Okay, there's an, the first Austrian force coming. So if we can defeat them in detail, if they show up little piecemeal shits like this, we can do it. Could try to storm it, should not try to storm it. Oh, that was beautiful. Okay. There, getting linked up. Brabant is the ruler. Length of war is the big difference. Okay. Get linked up. Okay. It's time to go hunting some Austrians. Okay, we're going to take a hit there. But that is a nice small force that they're not going to be able to win. So, uh oh, and this might be enough of you for for the day here. White piece. Can we get Breda? Nope. 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 A little bit of money. We're out. <laughs> Cheesy, but we're out. We're not, we're not dying for... <sighs> dying for dumb stuff. Jeez. Okay. Okay, it was worth it. We got it. We didn't die. Oh, boy. Do I need to insult another rival? Try to get me back above? So, you know what? I think we're going to just go after Cleves. Let's take a look. So that doesn't work there, but if we tell them to prepare for freaking war. So 
So, fill up those manpower banks. That's hard to want military access for me. Don't know. Quarantine it. Not messing around. Stuff at Austria. Yep, they just barely got their reinforcements in there in time. going to recall you. We're going to send you over here. Start working on all three of those colonies at the same time. Definitely going to beat me there. Do the spy network. Do the ships. Do that. We'll get the extra colonial range. doing get out there protect that trade oh boy well that was close and good thing the Zerg worked but Man, that was uh, it's not how I want to be taking fights in the future, that's for sure. There's Austria's idea groups, even. Now, well, let's start to do defensive. Lots of prestige, too. Of course, I don't exactly have a uh, disciplined advisor like I should have. That was a mistake. Okay, let's see what happens with the Treaty of Tordesillas here. I haven't started any new colonies. So we'll see. Maybe I'll get it done, but then does the Pope hate the shit out of me? Yeah, he does. That's okay. We're going to get it done. We're going to finish our colony here. Now what happens, I wonder when in slash if England goes, um, damn it. Not what I want. You know what? In response, need to do it. Accepting would destabilize France. Why would France be destabilized? Go to Milan. You know what? Yeah, we need to do that. Fair no expense. How's those inflation numbers doing? Yeah, not that bad. Eight prestige, one stability. Well, 
that's easy enough. New Austrian Emperor. I have no clue why accepting would destabilize and wasted a good chunk of money on them. Way more military than them, yep. There's Cleves. We can zerg down immediately on the start, which we will. Rugen's over there, don't worry about him. Bars down south, okay. So I'm leaving the peasants to a glorious victory. I guess I should follow him just in case Cologne goes to hell. Okay, there's the two fights. Should win both. First fight is looking good. Go. Oh, of course the Pezzer Revolt has to happen. And the St. Kitts need a fight, okay. It's ruthless, land fire damage, well, that's good, long term. Um, okay, artillery pieces, go. the Grand Captain. Yeah, let's be smart. Morale? Nah. Discipline. Let's get some discipline. Start going there. last Brussels is going to have issues there's no way around Brussels having issues it's barely enough to keep him under siege wall breached great oh, Rugen's over there that's cute Lawn's coming up. Come on, Cleve. Get out of the war. Don't belong in this war. Just get out. Okay, Antigua. Oh boy. Antigua looks okay. That is Antigua? That is not Antigua. Now, who hates me when I violate the Treaty of Tordesillas? Just the Violator and the Pope. Okay. So, let's take a look at the colonists. Because I think we need to get that little spot over there and then come back to Dominica. Okay, Battle for Cleve is over. Take the artillery units. Go. Go straight into them. 
Let's take a look, get rid of cleaves. War reps. Force religion even. There we go. There's an age objective. First one. Yay. Time on clones. Okay, as soon as we take the capital, it's gonna turn right around. Things are getting occupied by East Frisia. That's taken back. Good. Milan get forced out. Milan did get forced out. Okay. Siege of Colne's over. Go. You know what? Hold on. There's the mill axis. Julek under siege or no? Beck, you don't like me too much. There's an enemy fleet over there, so what's going on? Julik touches that province. No wonder that was such a damn issue. Nope, cannons need to stay. Force that open. Okay, come back. this military square no not yet I don't need it in this war I don't want to mess around with it now well we can fight you in a little bit actually you know what I have a few troops behind Just hunt him. Oh well, we got a big fight coming. Not the greatest leader, should be using the other leader, oh well. Okay, chase him back. Oh yeah, you're dead. Shit. My guys are dead now, probably. Nope, definitely don't do that right now. Oh, went past. Thank God. Okay. Get 
infantry out. There's the expensive ass cavalry out. I'm gonna go take Brussels again. Okay, point new diplomat, sounds great. That's a new technology, great. Gotta keep going a little bit longer. Can't take this good, move you down. I'm for sure getting that colony set up. Forget, forget it, I'm filing the shit out of that treaty. Okay. Seize outbreak. Damn. Hit the cannon amount. Okay. You want out of this war now, bar. Enthusiasm's high. That's a no. You're gonna really make me take your capital. And the answer is apparently yes. Um of war. It's already been taken. Get the ship cost down. Worry about Spanish squares later. Okay, hella money. That's great. Go. You're gonna come to your senses now, bar. Do not want you as a vassal. Thought about it for half a second, realized probably not a good plan. Bar. And you know what? Steal a bunch of money. Okay, where are we being converted at? A bunch of places. Okay, well, we're gonna end up probably converting, so we'll see which way we go in a bit. Okay, we've got a little bit of time. But then, yeah, I need to hit Tech 12. Obviously, before that fades, Rebel Uprising. Brought Separatists. Ah, uh, yeah, there. Yeah, that would make sense. Damn general died. Okay. War is over. Money. Go home. Go home repair. Go out. Day ticks over. Okay, so now we can start looking at peace deals. Holy shit. Okay, well that's the, that's the bridge too far, but all this other stuff ripe for the taking. Ten point two, not much money. So I guess the other option is see how much money I could get. Two hundred fifty bucks. No, don't need it. The humiliate. Just seize the territory. Get some nice cleaner borders too. 
And we've got the administration to handle it. Okay. <coughs> Oops, excuse me. So, there we go. Take that. Free shooter. Everything's okay. These are okay. I probably should start annexing Verdon. We'll annex Verdon. Wait for the month tick. We'll start coring. Sugar and Guadalupe. Okay. Now East Frisia's looking pretty good on the map here. Cologne's down to its little itty bitty parts there. Gonna have to put down some revolts. That's okay. If we've got the military to do it. Now. Also, power projection back up big time. Now, let's look at the mission. How much longer do we have to complete the mission? 1559. We can do it. So we need to do Marian. Right there. Okay, the problem is our damn capital is going to be right next to the freaking English. Not great. But it'll have to be doable. Okay. Okay, well, we've got guns at least. to fuck off Austria. Start that shit with me. Okay, we're definitely gonna have to convert. Where's the last island? Some kits. Oh, is it St. Thomas? It is. Sweden is doing St. Thomas. Well, you know, jeez. What are you what are you going to do about that? Okay, this is our last colony down there and then we are going straight for New Amsterdam. Which is uh, of course the forerunner of New York. Keep them, let them go. You know what? Keep them. You know what? If you straight on the province, you're less likely to rebel. Not by much. Great timing, though. Only cost me 932 guys. We've gained colonialism. CB. So here's the problem. England could decide to just take the shit out of my colonies. How much colonial maintenance am I paying? Not that bad. Why is the money so out of whack? Yeah, there's a war galley here that needs to not be there. And you guys... You know what? No. You guys go protect trade in the English note. Okay. 
then where's my other little fleet? Fleet? Okay. Sixteen bucks on the colonies. That's what's costing us. Should not have started it so early. Okay. Because it's exponential. St. Kitts, how much longer? 55 a year. God, that's going to take several years. You're going to take several years also. Stakes have been made. Okay, well, we're just going to have to grin and bear it for a while. Hopefully we get some nice events to help out. Okay, Explorer's dead. Not great, not bad. Um, we can run this for a while. Where's the next Rebel Uprising? Ferdinand Peasants. Okay. down. <sighs> I'm to pick the other province, so be it. They're toast. Now, do we have any more revolts to put down? No. Good. Get to the coast. Start drilling again. I was Sweden. Well, they wouldn't even take it. Ottomans arrivals there. PLC. PLC's got nope. Got problems with Lubeck. So wait a second. I need a new rival. Well, if I want to be a big boy, I make it Sweden or Great Britain, and then sign my own death warrant. Um, if I want to be cheeky little son of a gun, I do Bohemia because they can't do shit to me. So let's do that, because I don't want to die and lose all my damn colonies overseas. I just spent so much time and effort trying to get over there. And I'm going to tick down slowly on money. But that'll help. Long term. And I guess we could sell titles if we had to. But drop the crown land a bit. Then we could turn around and seize some right back. So if we have to do that, we will. I'm going to try not to. Okay, relations are okay there. Make the Pope. So yeah, three colonies ramping up to 16. Jeez. What if Treatus Tortoiseus makes it more expensive? Because I know I've, I'm also overextended. So once the overextension's done, my money will pop back up a bit. Okay. A little bit of clergy help. Newly papal influence. Now nah, let's take some prestige. Speaking of which, how are we doing? Well, it'd still be Catholic for now, but I don't know. We're gonna need to change that up in a bit, I'm sure. So let's let time run a little bit more, but we did very well in that war against Cologne. Not the choiciest, uh, most choice of territories, but, you know, land is land. I 
until 1543 to finish it. Crap, I probably have no way to get it done before 1543. I would have to just get all sorts of lucky rolls. Well. Some to Rome, take the prestige, just keep taking the prestige. Okay, let's see if I'm still negative on money. Barely. In fact, flat even. And once this gets ticked, 563, extra production efficiency. Anyway, we'll let that sit for now. But thank you for watching this episode. I'll see you next time.